So the other part of this particular protocol that we're, we're using here with the prostaglandin, the GnRH, and also the, the cedar is actually putting in the cedar when we give the prostaglandin shot. So basically, if you'll recall from our earlier talk, uh, the, the prostaglandin basically removes the CL that's on her ovary that's producing progesterone naturally. We remove the CL off of her ovary. We insert this device into her vagina. It releases prostaglandin and acts as an artificial CL if you want to think of it that way. When we remove this device, uh, depending on what, what protocol we're using, uh, several days or in some cases maybe t a couple weeks, but m most of the time it's going to be between five and seven days or five to eight days, we'll remove this maybe give another shot depending on the protocol and hopefully she will respond to that and come into heat when we want her to. The main thing on these cedars, uh, they do recommend that you wear plastic, uh, latex gloves and, and you know you could, this stuff can be absorbed through her vagina so there's progesterone in here and we don't want to accidentally absorb some of that through our skin particularly if we're hot and sweaty you know that that can really speed things along. Okay. So this is the, the, the device that we'll use to uh, insert the cedar into the vagina. Obviously you can look at this and tell it's brand new and, and clean and, and everything, but if we were doing several head of cattle, we would want to take this out, clean it off with a paper towel. I've got a little uh, chlorhexidine solution here. So I've got a little disinfectant, chlorhexidine in this case. Doesn't take much, put it in there disinfect your, your instrument between every cow. You want to be clean when you do this because you can, you can get dirt and debris up in that vagina and it can cause a, an infection. And you'll know it when you go remove these things because it'll be a, a foul odor and maybe worse things. All right, so we've got our instrument clean. Yeah, so the wings, the, the wings will be furthest in, deepest in the vagina, okay? So we want to put the tail end and we want the tail hanging down when we're through, okay? See that groove? That's to allow the tail to hang out. So we'll fold these ends down. The wings go in last towards her head. And we're almost ready to go to the cow. 